Western Massachusetts is known for its agriculture and local farms, with Hadley being labeled the asparagus capital of the world. Hadley's produce is served around the world, with its asparagus even being fed to the Queen of England. The Massachusetts agricultural scene is mostly comprised of small and family-owned farms, with 94% of farms taking in under $250,000 a year. Despite the lower earnings of these farms, Massachusetts ranks fifth in the nation for overall market sales. With agriculture being a popular job and hobby, we spoke to members of the gardening club at NHS and the shared garden manager at Abundance Farm to see the impact of gardening and agriculture on their lives and our community. Well, my mom loved gardening at home and through COVID she kind of like created a house garden. So I kind of picked up on that and it was fun. So far we're not really doing much, but we're, <laughs> we're planting uh, seeds right now so we can have a you know, functional garden in the summer. And we hope that we can build gardening beds in the future, so. We actually survey people every fall. And what we've learned that people get out of the Shared Women's Program is a couple of things. Some people really enjoy getting those materials at a rate that's affordable to them. Like, people have definitely told us that they might not have been able to start their first garden if it wasn't for this program and this helped them sort of kickstart being a gardener. Um, some people are looking for that. Um, a lot of people are looking for sort of like a gardening community with shared values. Um, just sort of knowing that the, there's this bigger vision of sharing the abundance that's in it. And um, also folks appreciate like getting tips from each other and learning how to garden. So just to know that in addition to food, one of the other things that we give out is um, native wildflowers. So we're also trying to use this program to help people change how they landscape and how they, you know, how they do flower gardens and things like that. So that it's like a way to rebuild our ecosystem at the same time. So we're feeding humans and we're hoping to feed also the wider ecosystem as well.